In an ideal world, what would a CCNA qualification do for you? What would be the ultimate result you'd like from it? Okay, well, the reason I asked this question was um, I need to be sure that, um, you know, when I talk about the CCNA, we're all on the same page. I did my CCNA because I wanted a better career, you know, I wanted to earn more money, you know, I wanted to, you know, a, a more, you know, worthwhile job. I wanted to progress in IT. Here's a reply um, from some of my CCNA students. Let's expand that for now. Okay, here it's a common theme, really common theme, and I'm sure again you, if you've um, filled in this questionnaire, thank you for your feedback, and for others, this is very interesting because, you know, we're all in the same shoes here, we're all in the same boat. Now here, here's here's some of here's some of the answers. Secure a job to help me get work as a network engineer. To become a network manager, to open up more career opportunities, to take me onto a CCMP, take me onto a CCSP, to help across, progress my career in telecoms, because it looks good on my CV. You know, I'd, I'd relish the chance to be a Cisco network engineer. It's all about progress. CCNA is all about progress. And these guys who have kindly replied to on my feedback from my survey know that CCNA will help them progress, it will help them get a new job, help them get a new career, it will help them earn more money. Okay? It's when you get a CCNA certificate, no one could ever question your expertise as a network engineer. Nobody, because you've got that certificate. Okay, one of the it's it's one of the most prestigious certifications. Employees need it. Employees uh, want you to have it because you know you, what you don't see in the background. Employees' systems have to be insured, and to be insured, okay, they must use qualified, relevant people. If a company uses a non-qualified person to work on a network, be it Microsoft or Cisco. It, inv it invalidates the insurance. So if something goes wrong in a network, if someone screws up the network, that company can't even claim on insurance because that person wasn't qualified in CCNA. And this is where you come in. As a CCNA qualified professional, you know, you add that extra added bonus to a company. They feel safe and assured that you have the skills to do the job, okay, and that because you're certified, their systems are insured with an insurance company. Now let's go back to this again. Here's the thing, to be the network, to be the best network administrator I can possibly be, and then move forward to CCMP. You can see everyone's into it. They want career changes, they want to progress to CCMP, you know, they want to make more money. Do you understand this? Do you, do you see where I'm coming from? CCNA is a very, 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 important everyone gets it everyone gets CCNA CCNA is um, for a lot of people um, the way forward to push through in their careers look at this again it would be great pushing my career because I'm a telecom engineer and it's a good thing that you understand what these systems really do to uplift my knowledge skills and better opportunity here's another one to help me obtain a job in the networking field that's a career changer there to help me get a better job this is all about being bonus. I will be proud to be CCNA certified. Do you see where I'm coming from? Job promotion, right here. So that, in a nutshell, is what a CCNA will do for my CCNA Jumpstart students. And no doubt, no doubt, you are probably in the same boat as my CCNA Jumpstart students. Okay. Just let's go into question five now. Here's a little cheeky question. In terms of CCNA, what what would you be willing to buy from me if I was only smart enough to offer it to you? Now, first things first, you know, I like to give away lots and lots of free information for my students. I mean, that's the way I work, really. And hopefully, you know, you appreciate it. It does take me time and effort to to put these things together. So 
I'm glad you know, especially you guys who've if we're in my survey, um, and you guys who are who are watching this video, I'm, I'm glad that hopefully you're finding some value um, in my uh, free materials that I give to you. I, I don't think anyone else is doing what I'm doing at the moment, to be honest with you. Yes, I'm also, you know, I also run a training company, okay, and um, I hope we're together. In terms of CCNA, what would you be willing to buy from me if I was only smart enough to offer it to you? So, here's what some people say. Some said, no, they've got everything. They found the jumps up very helpful, but I wouldn't buy anything at the moment. That's, that's good, that's fair enough. Learning CDs, some people along the lines of lab simulators. Some say one-on-one -on -one training, maybe classrooms. Some say simulators would be good. Okay, there's another simulator one again. Some people just want the pass certificate, you know. So, you know, this is um, that that is this is this is it, you know. Then you've got, and um, I'd like to buy the whole CCNA course, but not at this stage just yet. Then you've got, say, the CCMP. That like the CCNAP may be thrown in with the CCNA. Okay. So we got some very response, but it just looks like quite a you know. There's, there's people are specific in what they want in any training material. They like to have some CCNA books, right? That's good, you know. I think books are very important. If you see my um, my video, uh, the exam formula, you'll also see that um, books is a very important part of the formula. Um, CCNA question paper, laugh out loud. Well, you know what? There's so many brain dumps out there. You know, you could try them. <laughs> now, um, more information on Cisco products like firewalls and routers. Some talk about the finance costs of buy now, pay later. I mean, it's all sorts. But what you see is like there's a lot of exam preparation people are asking for. You're asking for a lot, a lot of people, maybe yourself is asking for loads of router and switch simulators. A lot of people like yourself are asking practical materials with the with any type of CSNA course you know a lot of people are asking for Cisco router configurations or router simulators it's all about simply simulations and exam preparations and DVD courses or tutorial courses and that's the right way that's the, it's the right way to think about it because you need a balance you need a balance of courses you need a balance of materials you need a balance of books and tutorial lectures and and practice exams and practical exercises, practical labs, and this is what you guys are telling me um, is what you need in an ideal CSNA course. So, I mean, this is real, real solid, good um, feedback. It helps me to understand where you're coming from. Um, I just want to say thank you to everybody. Um, I know I've got another 250 people I've got to show here, but I can't really do. I haven't got the time. But hit to you guys. I mean, I'm ta I want to thank everyone for, for completing the survey and this random sample of 50 here. Um, Abhishek, Martin, Joshua, Sydney, Dave, Shahida, Formacon, David, Vaughan, Adam, Abdul. I thank you all. Jason, Jamie. Johnson, Siva, Daniel, Said, Anna, Puja, Kevin, Hermina, Victor, David, Philip, Asawani, Naim, Roni, Amaja, Sonil, Monty, Matthias, Joshua. Um, I, th I thank you especially uh, for your feedback. Um, I'm really grateful for getting some insight knowledge to improve my own blog and my own videos. Um, even my own home study courses give me some ideas how to improve my um, um, a home study course. So, I want to thank you. I want to thank you for viewing my uh, videos. I want to thank everyone else for completing my survey. And um, yeah, I mean that's it really. Uh, thank you once again. Keep visiting uh, ccnaproblog.co.uk and also um, please make a comment about this video and leave it on the uh, on the blog post. Just post it. Uh, there's a comment section underneath the video. Please post as many comments as you like because the comments is what really makes my blog tick. It really makes me improve my blog and makes me put ever more better videos for you to make the most of. Um, thanking you once again. Okay, goodbye.